Welcome back to the Garza Gaming Channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you one of my new builds for Season 11 for Izunami, right? This build is a tank shredder, man. You're going to see all these heavies crying as you bathe in their tears. Oh, the tears of unfathomable sadness. Mm, yummy. So for today's build, we're going to use Felnot, Obsidius's Bow, Rage, Quint's Size, Crimson Claws, and the Ferocious Executioner. I think that this build is going to give us everything that we like to see in our Izunami build, right? Now, keep in mind, Izunami has her own buffs for pin and attack speed. So combined with the abilities that you get in this build, the crit, the passive damage of the Quins and the Odyssey is both the shred from the Quins and the Ferocious Deathbringer, I think is going to make this build just devastating. Now, for abilities, I build a little bit different. Now, normally I would build, you know, the highest cooldown ability first in order to cut down on its cooldown so I can use it more throughout the fight. But Izanami is different in the fact that her Sickle Storm is my bread and butter. For my playstyle, I like having that attack speed and that bonus damage on tap, right? It just blends very well with the, our build. And uh, as secondly, I like building that fadeaway. Now, for your playstyle, you might want to build spectral projection before fadeaway, but for my playstyle, I like having that, you know, invis on tap to initiate with or to use as an escape. And then third, I build spectral projection. And of course, always putting at least one point in her alt as soon as it comes up available. Now, keep in mind, like I say in all my videos, right, there's a million different builds that you can use for Izanami in Season 11. This is just one build that I'm using that works beautifully, especially against heavies. And also keep in mind, while I always start my every pretty much arena match with using my auto buys, it's up to you as an individual to know when to turn off auto buy and then adjust your builds if you need to depending on the situation, right? So now that we talked about the build and abilities, let's see this build in action. Okay, so here we go with our new season 11 Izunami build. Now I'm gonna tell you right now, I have not played an Izunami in so long. <laughs> I can't even remember. I think the last time I played Izunami was when I did my last video on it, right? And that build worked out beautifully. So we're gonna see how this build works out before um, today. So uh, Izunami, she's a very powerful god, man. She's not my strongest hunter, but not because of her kit, just because I haven't played her that much to tell you the truth. I think she's one of the few hunters I don't have to level 10 but she is very powerful in arena man she's one of the few um gods that has an invis capability and having an invis capability on top of a, an attack speed and pin buff uh and a slow on a hunter is just ridiculous dude so i really do enjoy playing this and i'm gonna tell you the truth i just have not gotten really a chance to play them now with this build today it should be very interesting because we're going to get a lot of uh, attack speed a lot of pin uh, in conjunction with her abilities, right? And we're gonna get some really nice passive damage. Uh, and then a lot of shred. And that's the important thing is having a lot of burst speed, burst attack speed with shred, because that's what allows you to pair up those, um, pair up those tanks, or those heavens, I should say. Nice. Oh man. Now that's one thing I love about her too. Even once we get her attack speed up, especially even if she runs out of mana, she's still a beast, man. And the cool thing is, once she gets down all the way down to 50%, she gets more attack power under her belt. So that makes makes her very very deadly. They almost had me. Ooh, 
was craziness. I cannot believe they survived. Alright, all right, get back. Don't be silly. Yeah, today we've one um, Reaper and the rest are, uh, are pugs, so... <laughs> You know, there's no telling how this is going to go. So far, it's not too bad. But my videos are not about how many games we win or lose, or how good we do, how bad we do. It's about trying out various different builds and seeing what works and what doesn't work, right? So that's all that matters. As long as we get enough to finish out this build, it's really what I want to check out. There we go. Out of there because she was low on health. Yeah, anytime a Nox goes inside you, you need to look up and see what their health is because it might be a screen for help. <laughs> Last thing you want to do is have them trying to escape death and you just go running Leroy Jenkins thing into the freaking battle, right? It's like, thanks, buddy. Ooh, she got deleted, son. She got deleted, son. As long as we keep playing off that Nox, we're going to be all right. We can get those those arcs flowing. Get those arcs of flowing. Go back and get some more items. I'm liking the teamwork thus far, especially for a pug group. These guys are doing really, really well. My heart and soul is into this game with them. <laughs> They're doing a really good job, man. I love it. it. It warms my soul when I see teamwork in the wild outside of a Reaper group. It's really, really awesome. Might as well go top off now that everybody's clear. Smarter, not harder, baby. Let's go. All right. All right. I don't know if that's going to be a, a fake out or that's really going to upgrade me. So I'm going to give it a second. Ah. 
Oh. Get some mana. Meow. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, dude. Had her. Get it. Did the rat get her? Yes. Nice cleanup. Nice cleanup. Very nice. And yeah, once we get our attack speed up, once we get those sides, it's going to be on like Donkey Kong. We're almost there. Just need a little bit more attack speed. right into her dude did not mean to go that way that was my bad that was a thousand percent my bad went the wrong way come on we got this baby we got this come on come on get me in there all right there we go Got her though. Her reinforcements arrived. <laughs> Her reinforcements arrived. Come on, dude. Come on. I need to stop dying because the getting back in here is a freaking nightmare. Alright, and it's costing me damage. Very nice. <laughs> yeah, when she gets in you like that, just go inside a uh, damage. Anything that does damage. And they take she's not immune to damage when she's inside you. Hurt. 
Alright. Let's go finish out our build, baby. Let's go finish out our build. There we go. Oh, it's all like Donkey Kong. Jenkins that one all right so we got a full build now and then some Dude, for as many times as I've died we're doing all right oh come on 20 seconds you gotta kill me come on give me in there give me in there give me in there get me in there All right, full build and then some. Let's go. <laughs> oh, they stopped me. They stopped me. Ah, that was silly. That was silly. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Baby, game point, game point. Ah, oh, Lee, dude. <laughs> I died way too much that game. I died way too much. But I mean, it is what it is. I shouldn't have took some of the chances I took, but I mean, it is what it is. I think we did all right. The build felt beautifully. Dude, I was like shredding through them people like freaking nothing. And they had some pretty good protections. I felt like I was shredding through them fools. Yeah, not bad at all, man. 14, 5, and 16. 32,000 player damage, 20,000 minion damage. Not a bad run. Again, I could have died a lot less. The last three or four deaths was just me being stupid. But, I mean, it is what it is, man. Sometimes it rolls like that, right? All right, so let's see how we came out. So we came out with 230 physical item power, 1.1 attack speed. Now, keep in mind, this is before any type of your buffs, right, from your attack. So that's really, really awesome. So we had full attack speed. And then we had 15 light steel, 20, 10 flat pin, 10 percentage pin, and 65% crit with 20% cooldown reduction. Man, and all, a very solid build with Izunami, right? Again, this is just one of my builds that I'm sharing with you to see if it works for you, right? Hey, man, are you playing Izunami in Season 11? And so if you have a different build, put it down in the comments down below. I'd love to see what you're rolling with, right? And don't forget, if you ever want to play with some really cool people, come check out our Discord. We got an invite to the Discord description to any of our videos and our website, guardsofgaming.com. Again, if you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button, turn on those notifications. I'm Dark Garza, your OG on the GSC. We'll catch you next time.